yeah, just about three years ago, I'd wake up and I'd choose what to do then. And usually I choose to literally like watch porn first thing in the morning. And then I choose what to do then. And then, you know, I mean, I want to be a drop shipper, but that's not really in my mind because, you know, I'm just choosing what to do, which is, this is what so many people do. Maybe you do this. You don't actually write down exactly what you're going to do tomorrow. So tomorrow, like today, when you do wake up, it's literally just, you're, you're allowing your Jeffrey brain, like you're, you're allowing your lizard brain to just choose something. And most of the time your brain's going to choose the easy thing to do. I had no routine in the second one, which is so interesting because no productivity guru ever speaks about this. No productivity YouTuber or anything like that ever speaks like this. And it's actually diets. I had a terrible diet back then. I used to be like a weightlifter and I used to think that the way to, you know, like make muscle and stuff is just eat as much as possible and to eat junk food. And I never really thought about health before. There's going to be a topic in this video, which is, uh, regarding health and you're going to find that very interesting but at least for now the stuff that i was eating three years ago snacks sugar completely processed food the kind of like cheap food easy meals that you can buy from aldi like cheap stores bring them home and put them wrapped in plastic and stuff put them in the microwave or the the oven and it's just done nice and easy there is a hidden cost to cheap food and it's your health, your productivity. And I didn't realize at the time what this bad diet was doing to me. But, wow, it was actually one of the biggest reasons why my productivity wasn't good. Because what it meant was that when I would eat this like horrible diet, when I would overeat like these, these bad foods, you know, the junk food, like you know exactly what it is, right? If you're expecting me to tell you like the perfect diet or something, it's like, you didn't even need that. You know, within a split second, if some food you're about to eat is a cope or not. You don't need any person, some like bodybuilder to tell you, oh yeah, but it's got hyper, you don't need it, bro. You can take one look at something and just say, cope, 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 that's healthy, cope, cope, cope that's healthy if it's pancakes it's cope it doesn't matter if you put protein powder in them it doesn't matter if you're gonna have them before a workout oh, carbs before a no it's cope and it's bad for you and it's bad for your brain and you're not going to be as productive if you eat that kind of stuff so i was eating this like junk food literally all through the day i'd wake up and have like a massive breakfast thinking i was bulking and everything and all that was really happening was that my progress at the gym was was really nice but my brain power was was just sapped We'll go later more into like how to fix your diet in this video as well. Another thing I was doing wrong at this time was I was exhausted training first thing in the morning. I don't really like the way this video is going to be honest. Is this a shit video, bro? I just started getting bare negative thoughts. I was like, all right, this is a shit video. I'm presenting it shit. I think my voice is too high pitched, so I sound like a pussy and I hate myself. And I just started getting a barrage of negative thoughts. So I'm just gonna deep breathe for a second. Hope you don't mind, bro. I'd like to take the glasses off as well, but then I have this light on so that you can like see me better. And then it'll just be like too much light because it's, it's uh, almost nighttime here. We apologize for this <laughs> interruption of this unprofessional YouTuber. You know, this is actually, you know what? This is actually really interesting. The biggest thing that's bothering me right now that I was literally just about to end this video and just call it a night was that I'm, I'm kind of bloated because I had a fairly large meal a few hours ago and it's still like, it's like pressing in my stomach and it just, it's not the right vibe to like record. It's not the right vibe to, um, to speak so much. And it's interesting, like I was gonna just take the L and just end this video, but it is actually interesting that literally what I've just spoke about is what's happening here. Genuinely, like I was, this wasn't fake or any, I promise you, right? I was literally, I stopped looking at the script and I was just like, I don't even wanna do this video. Like my stomach's actually really full. I just feel uncomfortable. It's like, I just, you know, I'll end the video and I'll do it tomorrow. And literally the reason why was just that I just had like a big meal full of carbs two hours ago. How interesting is that? And the point that I just made to you, the reason why my productivity used to be so low or probably still is so low is because um, 
of like a bad diet. I genuinely didn't actually expect to like give you this message. Like I, I wrote this script down like yesterday and um, yeah, that, that's actually really interesting. I feel like a little bit better just telling you the truth actually. So I'll try and continue and we'll see what happens, right? I hope that this, I was also doubting the structure of this video. So I don't know, tell me if I was um, right or wrong with that. Is the structure of this video shit or not? But the I've just listed down a bunch of things that I was doing wrong at that time. And then I've got like a bunch of like, I think really good strategies for you to take um, going forward, which we'll dive deep to.